everybody, it's Miss Bond again, and I'm here with Mr. Charlie. Mr. Charlie. And this week we are going to learn all about primary colors. Absolutely, the primary colors. So I have this here. This is a color wheel. Yellow, blue, red. And those are the primary colors. A color wheel helps us understand colors and not how the colors can work together. So we have the three primary colors, and I call them the superhero colors. Why are they so awesome, Charlie? What can red, yellow, and blue do? Uh, we'll count every color in the whole wide world. They can mix to make every color. So we are in the whole wide world. Whole wide world. But you know they cannot make black. Nope, or white. Nope. But they can make green, orange, purple, teal, maroon, lots of different colors. But we're going to learn the basic today and how you can mix red, yellow, and blue together to make orange, green, and purple. Okay. So, we need a Sharpie. And we need moss. Primary colors. And certainly we need pepper. <laughs> um, we instead of choosing red, we chose pink because the pink is just a light red. And the lighter the colors, the the better it mixes together, and you're able to see how they mix just a little better. So we chose light we chose pink, we chose a light blue, and the yellow is just fine. So for this project, we are going to make a rainbow with only using pink in place of our red, yellow, and blue. Mom, that was mine actually. Okay. So the first thing you need is your black Sharpie. Now if you do not have a black Sharpie, you need to use a light color to draw out your rainbow like yellow. You do not want to use a black washable marker because all of that black will bleed into your color and just make your rainbow really dark. So um, if you have a black sharpie, start with that or a light marker such as yellow. So we're going to start drawing our rainbow. So your first step of drawing a rainbow is to draw a big bump or an upside down U for the top part of your rainbow. And I started at the bottom and I ended at another side of the bottom. So Charlie, you wanna try yours? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is gonna be a big rainbow. That is awesome. And your Sharpie's not really working, so let's get you a different one. No one either. This one looks a little better. Okay, so let's switch up. And you need to draw seven bumps to your rainbow. So I have one, and another one right underneath it, two, three, four, five, six. Good job, Charlie. One, two, three, four. You can make some come in the middle a little bit more. Five. Six. Seven. Good job. I have a lot to color. Me too. So what is the first color in the rainbow? Red. Red. And instead of using red, we're going to use pink. So find your pink marker, Charlie. Oh, and he's doing a good job. He's capping his Sharpie first before we go on to the next one. 
and you're gonna color as nice as you can, fill in as much space that outer part of your rainbow pink. Great job, Charlie. So the next color in a rainbow is what? Green. Does it go red green? <laughs> oh, these are orange. It goes red orange. But Charlie, we don't have orange. We only have pink, yellow, and blue. What are we going to do? Mix. Mix Cut. it up. Very good. So what two colors mix to make orange? Pink and yellow. Pink and yellow. Let's try it out. We'll do a little part of my rainbow. If I do some pink here, and then yellow on top. <gasps> do we get orange? Yeah. We sure do. So we're going to color the next part of our rainbow pink, and then we're going to color yellow on top of it to make it orange. You ready? Here we go. So Charlie and I finished mixing our orange and we even went ahead and we did the yellow part of our rainbow. So the next part, Charlie, is what? Green. And we don't have a green marker, so what are we going to do? Mix it up. up. I mean, so what's your colors, color, Charlie, mix to make green? Blue and yellow. Blue and yellow. So on our next part of our rainbow, we're going to mix blue first. So draw the blue first, then the Mine. yellow, and we'll watch it turn green. Charlie and I now finished our blue or green and we mixed it up the blue and the yellow to make the green we went ahead and did the blue now last we need to make the purple part of our rainbow but instead of using purple what two colors can we use we need to use pink and blue to mix it up! Yes! So, I mean, mix the color up. Yep. So, we're going to start and we're going to either put the pink or the blue down and then put the other one on top to get the last part of our rainbow. All right, so here we are. We have our two rainbows. And once you finish your rainbow, you can go ahead and add different things around your rainbow like flowers, sun, clouds, whatever you want. Charlie even came up with a good idea and he thought that because coming up is what? Mother's Day. Mother's Day. And so he wanted to make this for his mom. And if you want, you can make your rainbow into a picture for your mom as well. Final pictures. You want to show them your Charlie? 
his rainbow and heart. And here is mine. And everything we drew on our pictures and colored in was with the three primary colors. What are the three colors, Charlie? Blue.